Stevenson Falls 13-10 here tonight to Dickinson, Glenn Clark at the Green Turtle Classic, powered by SFMSports.net. Joined now by head coach Paul Cantabene. Coach, obviously the storyline for the weekend, the uh, the face-off department. You got Jeremy in there, gave him a chance. Should we expect to see more of him moving forward? Well, yeah, he gives us a chance. He grinds it out. You know, the other two guys, Nathaniel and uh, Dan, you know, they're good kids. They're just young and they're just not as mentally there as we need them to be. And hopefully, you know, they'll bounce back and get obviously get opportunities and stuff. But, you know, Jeremy gave us a shot. You know, we got to be better on the ground balls to help him out. You know, we had several chances at him. We just missed him. And I think that hurt us the most. You know, those 50-50 ground balls, you didn't get the better off. You know, and that's what we made it and that's what we need to do. I can sense that this one's tough. I know last night you talked about, hey, that's a great win, but it means as much as what happens tomorrow night. And, yeah, right. And yeah, and I, mean, I, just didn't, you know, I just didn't like the way we started the game. I didn't like some of the things that were going on for how we played, and we got to do better. we got to play 60 minutes. we got to do these things better and for us to be successful. And uh, right now, you know, that's kind of the disappointing part is that we had some of our older guys we thought and were doing things well. Not and it led to second chances, and we got to yeah. do better. Is part of that in general for a young team learning how to deal with success? That you guys have two back-to-back wins over really good teams? Well, I just think it's no. I think it's more. It's not success necessarily. Is what we can mentally handle. You know, we have okay. to be mentally tougher. You know, these kids can handle something. Some things not. We just got to keep grinding out. You know, we got to get ready for toughs. And then you know, we got you know a lot of games ahead of us against a lot of good teams. Still got Lynchburg. We still got. Um, uh, York and yeah. you know, so we got a lot of good games ahead of us that we can win and you know we got our conference obviously we'll be all right and we just got to keep grinding we're still positive we got good guys we have to play better and we have to start getting our guys playing at a maximum level we're not getting the best out of all our guys right now you mentioned toughs let's look ahead to Tuesday night real quick this is the number one team in the country you've got history yep. with them obviously yep. uh, what are you expecting coming in here to Mustang well, we Stadium know they're not going to change anything they do and we you know we we're not going to change much that we do but we have to understand who they are and how they play and we got to control the ball and we got to win some face offs <laughs> us a chance and uh you know we're gonna do our best we can you know i mean i think we always kind of do the best we can and scrap it up the best we can with everybody and we play at a high level at times and we'll, we'll see what we can do let's get some final thoughts this event and once again a tremendous success i know on the field you would have asked for more success but yeah. the event in general being so important and such the backbone of it what just your thoughts on how everything came well, together we know, this we're just weekend. really excited to be able to host one of the best events around and really give division three a platform to show what we're all about and that's what we want you know you got to thank all the coaches you know they did a great Great job sacrificing the weekend to come down here, taking away home games for them and stuff like that. You know, it was great. I really thank all of them for being here and Stevenson and everything they did to help us put it on. And that's what it's all about, to put on a great event. Unfortunately, sometimes you don't win in your own event. But, you know, I think overall, you know, you got to look at it. what this is great for the players. They understand what a great time it is to come and play in these games. It's good for the game. It's good for the coaches. It's good for all the different levels out there. And for us, you know, it's just a great thing. And we're really excited about the whole event in general. I think it's great. We, we thank everybody for coming out the lax sport network inside lacrosse lax magazine you know everybody was here to yeah. really promote it and that's what it's all about to give these kids a platform to show what they're all about and i think it was a great weekend coach appreciate the time as always best of luck moving forward thanks much he is coach paul cantabene i'm glenn clark signing off from the green turtle classic powered by sfmsports.net